Hey guys, Fythor here with another tutorial. This time, we're going to get your games for Windows Live back up and running, especially for your Steam users. So, without them telling us, they completely and utterly changed the name. So it's not game for Windows Live anymore, it's game for Windows Marketplace client. So, to simply do this, just install this. Don't un do not uninstall the other previous. If you run into problems, then you can uninstall the uh, previous, but I did not uninstall the previous. I just installed this along with it, had no problems. Um, that's all you have to do for this. Okay, so if this doesn't work, and I'm going to show you that I was able to get it up and running. So. Here is my Steam. I'm going to hit play game. Yes. And there you go. It's running. No errors, no crashes. It doesn't just, that little DirectX 11, DirectX 10 doesn't pop up. You choose one, it doesn't just stop. It actually plays. So, um, I'm actually going to go in game real quick and uh, let it play for a bit. So you can see, we'll go into the benchmark real quick, let it load up. But yeah, so they that's all they did. That's really all you have to do to get it to work, as you can see here. Now, they for some reason, it changes all your resolution. So you lose like 720. You lose you, you're, all your, your resolutions get confuzzled. So in my opinion, put it in window mode because I, there's the way it changes the resolutions there's no monitor that would support any of those resolutions at all I'm sorry it was like 1280 by 762 62 it, yeah so I would recommend putting it in window mode or leaving it alone in full screen if you enjoy full screen don't mess with it because it's gonna jack up all your resolutions now that we know that is playing we're gonna go ahead and back out of this all right yes I would like to leave okay so if that doesn't work then what you want to go to do is you want to search for your games for my Windows Marketplace you get Windows 8 then you hit your Windows 8 button and you just simply type in games it should be the second one right here and you want to launch it once it launches You'll be prompted to sign in and try launching your game straight from here. However, I do not have my game from here. I have uh, some demos, game add-ons for Microsoft Flight, which was, by the way, okay, I guess. But anyway, or horrible. But if that doesn't work, I will make another tutorial because it gets very, very, very more in-depth than this. But this is just the first part. Uh, please comment below if you have any problems. I will try my best to help out. But once again, I hope this helps uh, helps you and get your game up and running.